side offers a slight barometric change. It's hinting that my absolute favorite season is almost here. Autumn sets up the golden occasion for us to look into EY129, a pigment that is normally associated with green coal. This cherished pigment is believed to have a close resemblance with PG-10, the original green coal, but has been discontinued. Nowadays, PY-129 is the industry's de facto green coal, although some brands have been known to assign a different name for PY-129. This video presents a compelling case on why pigment education is crucial to our growth as watercolor painters. It is never wise to buy watercolors based on the assigned name. Similar with relationships, we need to go beyond the label and of course the packaging to progress effectively. It is imperative that we know the pigment makeup of our watercolors. We'll talk more about this in a bit. First, let's look at today's protagonists. We have PY129 from Winsor & Newton, My Mary Blue from Michael Harding Watercolors. This is one of the newest players. Sennelier's Brown Green is also here. We also have Isaros Chartreuse Yellow, Rich Green Gold from Daniel Smith, and Deep Green Gold from Roman Schmel. As always, my tools are ready. Alright, so please enjoy the next video clips because from here, I will let the colors speak volumes for themselves.
Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoy the video. Please don't forget to share and to subscribe and I'll see you next time.